KGUN 9 on your side sports. It's bad news, good news for Arizona football. The bad, running back Nick Wilson is expected to be out for a few weeks with a knee injury. The good news, though, Anu Solomon practiced today for the first time since injuring his knee six weeks ago. Here's Rich Rodriguez on why he's still optimistic for the rest of the season. One, the attitude of the team, and particularly the seniors. You know, the, I have a small senior class, but they've been really good leadership. I'm talking about really good. And then certainly the... The, the young talent we have and the way they're working. And then I guess the third thing is recruiting. And after four straight losses, the Wildcats get a break this weekend with a bye. Hopefully the Cats can regroup before they take on Stanford at home on the 29th. And the city of Cleveland has another reason to celebrate sports this year. For the first time in 19 years, the Cleveland Indians are going to the World Series. The Indians wasted no time getting runs on the board. Starts right here in the top of the first. Back, has to play it off the carom and then has trouble with it. That's going to score a run and the Indians on the board, one nothing. Indians still up in the third. Carlos Santana sending it way back into right field for a homer. They had score again in the fourth, and Toronto's World Series dreams would be crushed right here in the bottom of the ninth. Series. This kid put these guys to sleep, man. That's of course, why the celebrations the continue in the locker room. Looks like so much fun. Cleveland manager and former Wildcat Terry Francona leading the Indians to win the ALCS 4 to 1 against Toronto. Meanwhile, on the West Coast, the Cubs did not let this game slip away. The drama started in the bottom of the second inning. Two outs, runners on first and second. Adrian Gonzalez thrown out at home on a controversial call that would end that inning. Cubs scoring two runs in the top of the fourth. Addison Russell up to bat. That is going to do the trick. Into right center field and two runs are going to score. And the Cubs have their biggest lead of the night, 8-2. Into right center field, ball sinking in a hurry. Peterson with a diving catch. Tagging and scoring for another run is Bryant. The ball gets away. Here comes Rizzo. Uh, play again tomorrow. <laughs> play again tomorrow. The Cubs have not won a World Series since 1908. Wow. So they're not going to give this up easily. No. So it'll be really fun to keep watching them play. Thanks, Jennifer. Coming up, the legend of the Great Pumpkin.